Support and resistance is one of the most widely used concepts in trading because it's where traders believe price will see an increased amount of buying or selling, which can be used to time the entries and exit points of trades. So in this lesson, I wanna show you what support and resistance is and how it can be useful. So if you're ready, let's get started. Support is defined as a common price area where the stock has trouble going down after multiple attempts as this is due to more buying demand at a specific price area. So it's an area where there's a concentration of demand where buyers are more inclined to buy and sellers are less willing to sell. So since support is an area where there's likely to be an increased concentration of buying, it's a critical level traders look for when price is falling as support can often act as a trigger to buy with the expectation that the price will stop falling and reverse to the upside. Resistance is the same concept, it's just flipped the other way. Resistance is defined as a price area where the stock has trouble going up and this is due to more selling interest at a specific price level. So resistance is an area where there's a concentration of selling where sellers are more inclined to sell and buyers are less willing to buy. So since resistance is an area where there'll be an increased amount of selling pressure, it's going to be a critical level traders look for when the price is rising as resistance can often act as a trigger to sell or go short with the expectation that the price will stop rising and reverse to the downside. So these areas are going to be important to identify because they represent important points in time where there has been a shift in buying interest versus selling interest. And we can use these areas to help anticipate future price movement. Because if the price has had trouble going up or down at certain price levels in the past, then it's likely they will have a short-term predictable reaction to those levels again, where we can try to profit from. Using support and resistance in trading is just like using a roadmap with directions on how to get to your destination, as it tells you what roads to take and where to turn in the most efficient way possible but in terms of trading it's like a guide to show you when to get into a trade where to take profit and where to exit for a loss in the most efficient way possible i hope you all learned something and i'd like to thank you so much for watching